What is up guys, Tech James here. Hopefully all of you guys are doing well. Um, I don't normally make videos like this. I do on the odd rare occasion, but I found a really interesting article on Wololo.net and um, it's about a PSP homebrew developer conference in 2020. When I saw this, I had to check the date because this is the sort of thing that used to happen in 2008, maybe 2009, but the fact we're getting a PSP developer conference on March the 28th of 2020, so this year it's coming up fairly soon I just had to make a video on this just to let you guys know now it's not a massive thing it's not as big as it used to be um, but it is still cool that lots of people are still interested in the PSP homebrew scene um, that they thought they should make a PSP developer conference now they haven't asked me to promote this or anything I'm just promoting it because I'm not sure how many viewers it's gonna get and I know I've probably got one of the biggest like PSP channels that still makes videos um, about the PSP content on YouTube so I just thought I'd make a video letting you guys know and I will link all of their stuff in the description so their channel uh, the live stream and um, all of the information but yeah here it is we can take a look at it in this video and just read a little bit about it and it says save the date PSP homebrew developer conference on March the 28th and here is the kind of like logo that they've gone for and yeah this is over on Wololo so obviously shout out to them for the article and um let's just read what it says so they were contacted by someone called red like roses to let you guys know about an upcoming online conference that's going to be 100 percent about psp homebrew development so that is the date if you guys want to tune in it's on march the 28th 4 p.m est and 8 p.m gmt the conference will consist in short presentations about homebrew development, past, present and future. Now the future stuff is obviously going to be the most interesting. Um, so they're going to talk about exploits, old exploits, new ones as well. They're also going to talk about the Pandora battery, which I never actually used one of these before. And um, the M33, to be honest, I don't even know what that is. But here is the um, developer conference trailer. I guess oh yeah this is like the announcement trailer um so i'll leave a link to this in the description as well it's um it's not only minecraft gameplay it does have you know psp screenshots and stuff so yeah they'll be talking about the nintendo 64 emulator ds emulators exploits old exploits there's also something new called psp chat which sounds kind of crazy um but yeah it's very interesting so the PSP is fairly into the retro stage of a console's life cycle, um, but in this guy's opinion, it's still the best handheld that ever was. I agree, I think the PSP is a lot better than the DS, even the 3DS as well. Um, so if you're interested in console development, console exploits, or just curious in general, uh, make sure to save the date. And um, as I said, I'll leave their stuff. Uh, it looks like they've got a Discord server, got the YouTube video for the announcement. But anyway, let's take a look and see what the PSP developers are actually doing. So this guy called the Mr. Ion2 is doing GoldenEye PSP and more. Uh, this guy called Matt Hugh, oh god, I'm going to completely butcher these names, so I'm probably not even going to bother. But this guy is doing the M33 hack and the Pandora battery hack. That might be an interesting one to check out. Moto Legacy is doing Call of Duty Zombies and Open FNAF, not too sure what that is. Next guy is doing MCPSP, Minecraft PSP, not too sure, and the Stardust engine. Uh, this guy is doing the Daedalus 64, N64 emulator. Um, Notchy is doing PSP chat discord client is that like discord on the psp that might be a bit of a security risk but it'd be interesting to see what they've got anyway um this guy's doing fury i think that's a game like a japanese game I'm not 100 percent sure um this guy uh master men's doing counter-strike psp and paint pro um oh I, I have heard of this game before actually splunky is that how you set and um cross-platform dev uh various psp um utilities and libraries i think and this guy's a homebrew developer and this guy's also a homebrew developer so yeah a psp conference in 2020 that is insane to me like it's so crazy how long have i been doing psp stuff maybe since 2016 2017 i was doing it a bit before but i didn't make videos on it or anything like that you know i was just doing it when i was at school because i was just kind of bored you know and but yeah that's crazy to see a psp conference because i've never actually seen these i thought these things died 
died off maybe maybe at a push 2011 that might have been around about the last one but yeah crazy to see another one happening so make sure to check it out if you guys enjoyed this quick video as always leave a like um and yeah thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next one